It's sad that the app can't predict when a person will die. So Anna has less than two days left. She was both scared and disbelieving. So she sneaked to the morgue and found the dead man's cell phone and tried to open it. But it needed a password. She tried to use a man's fingerprints and failed, thinking it might be facial recognition. So he broke the man's eyes open stiffly, not realizing that they were really open. Countdown to zero, time to spare. When she got home, Anna tried to delete the app and realized she couldn't. The more she thought about it, the more scared she got, and she just smashed her cell phone. The next day, she went to the supermarket to buy a new one, and before she could leave the house, the app was automatically installed. Anna was a little overwhelmed, and just as she was backing up, a dark figure suddenly appeared in the rearview mirror. Looking back, there's nothing! Anna hurriedly climbed out of the car and the owner of the car that was hit came down and shouted angrily. The man's name is Nick, and he pulls out his cell phone with only 18 hours left. They found an exorcist on the recommendation of the priest.